So I'm now going to prove that the product of x and the log base n of a is equal to the log base n of a raised to the x exponent. I'm going to start off by examining log base n of a. And what I'm going to do is say that this has a value. So I'm going to let that value be the value y. Then by definition of that logarithm, y is the exponent I put on an n to get the value a. Now, according to my property of equations, I can take this one equation and raise both sides to any exponent that I would like to raise it to. Hence, I'm going to take both sides and raise both left and right side to the exponent x. So I'll end up with n to the y raised to the x equals a raised to the x. According to my property of exponents, I can take these two exponents and multiply them. However, I'm going to put the x in front of the y to keep the order in alphabetic order. At this point, I'm now going to rewrite these using the definition of a logarithm. Notice, x times y is the exponent I can put on an n to get a to the x. That is, x times y must be the log base n of a to the x. Now I'm going to get rid of my y by going back to what I originally assigned the value of y, log base n of a. So by substitution, oops, that's not a y, of a equals log base n of a to the x which means I have proven that the left and right hand side of those equations are in fact equal.